how to add underwater effect in FL Studio. So that's what I'm going to show you guys in this super quick and easy tutorial. So without further ado, let us begin. So I have this sample pattern that I just made a few seconds ago. So it kind of sounds like this. Okay, so to add the underwater filter, what you want to do is to head over to the mixer. And then once you're here, you can edit out any track that you want to edit out right here. But for me, I'll just edit out the master track right here. So just select on any track you want to edit. But for this video, I'll just select the master track. Then after that, just head over to the left side over here and then just click on the first slot. So once you're here, what you want to do is to just look for filter over here. And then just look for fruity love filter so just click on that and then this option will now pop up so once you're here just click on this arrow right here in the top left of the window for the fruity love filter and after that just go to presets and then once you're here just look for simple triangle low pass lfo so just click on that and then there you go so after that you can now edit out the knobs right here to your liking so yeah feel free to edit out these knobs if you want to and then once you're done editing out the knobs right here in the filter you can now exit out of here and after that just make sure in the master right here or the mixer just make sure that this is switched off so make sure that the fruity love filter is switched off then after that just right click that filter afterwards just click on create automation clip so just click on that and then an automation clip will now be added to our timeline right here so what you want to do from here is to just simply um, raise these circles right here. So just raise the first one and the middle one right here so that we can add a smooth curve in the end. So there you go. We now have our underwater filter right here. So when I play it, there you go. We now have our underwater filter added. And then after that, you're pretty much done. So yeah, that's pretty much it on how to add underwater effect in FL Studio.